And welcome back. Well, starting this Friday, the Skylight Music Theater presents the Tony Award winning Broadway musical La Caja Fall. And this is a sort of entertainment breaking news. You're getting a first look at the costumes and the set. Can you see it? I love that. Doesn't that look beautiful? That's a great picture. Well, you may be familiar with this story because it inspired the 1996 film The Birdcage. Which with we Robin both Williams. loved. Yeah, mm -hmm. it was a great movie. And we're here now with the director and choreographer, John De Los Santos, along with Chris March formerly a Project Runway All-Star and now two-time costume designer for the Skylight. <laughs> I bet the Skylight's excited to have Chris back. That is fantastic. They can't get rid of me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they want to. <laughs> I don't think so either. You did My Fair Lady last time, which is great. And those mm -hmm. costumes were extraordinary. The hats. So Thank you. It was a lot of fun. That mm -hmm. is super fun. Okay, let's talk about this Tony Award-winning Broadway musical. Super exciting, I bet, to be the director and choreographer. Absolutely, yeah. And it's great to do it in Milwaukee because we're utilizing all local talent. We didn't have to outsource at all. So you're going to be seeing a lot of very familiar faces from Skylight and from local theaters here. And so seeing all your friends and clothes that this guy's designed is pretty incredible. Yeah. yeah. If you loved the movie Birdcage like we did, is it how similar is it? Because I know it was very, based off that. Yeah, it's very similar. The musical actually came before yes. um, the Birdcage did. And so the Robin Williams film is a utilization of all three versions. So it's very, very close. Oh, okay. I think our costumes are a little more extravagant. Just a tad? Yeah. Just a tad. <laughs> it's so fun to see that rehearsal video because that's, you know, no costumes yet. <laughs> um, you know, the set isn't there. You're, you're not, you know, looking at the stage when we see those. Um, you've got a 22-piece orchestra, mm -hmm. um, which is incredible in, in, in combination with the, the costumes. I bet it's going to just be an incredible thing to, to behold. It's huge. Mm -hmm. Not huge. Huge. <laughs> yeah. huge. It's a very funny show, which mm -hmm. I think is um, so great great about the the obviously one of the reasons why it's won so many Tonys it's just it's a wonderful story it's very funny tell us a little bit about your character and the plot for people who aren't familiar with it well basically what I do is I direct and choreograph the entire thing mm -hmm. so I'm in charge of the dances I'm in charge of making sure there's room for the head pieces that he does <laughs> but also to bring out kind of the the love story and the family side because it is a family show it's mm -hmm. about the importance of family and I think that around the holiday season that's one of the greatest advantages we have to doing this story now so we want people to have a great time and love the visuals but also leave with a heartfelt message and you got some actors that Milwaukee loves in this show mm -hmm. we do yes. we do Ray and Norman Norman Moses, who was in My Fair Lady last year. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, this is a little different for him. <laughs> <laughs> but he's fantastic. They both are. It's really fun. What are their roles in the show? They are the two main characters. Two leads. They play Alban and George, which is the Nathan Lane and Robin Williams roles. Right? Yes. Awesome. Love it. Yeah. What does the show mean to you guys? Why is this an important piece to put on? I think that it's a very universal story. I mean, yes, it's about drag queens and feathers and boas and all of that, but also it's about, you know, kids being embarrassed by their parents and growing up and reconciling that and just having a good time and loving one another. I got to know what inspired you to come back, Chris, because this is your second time with the Skylight Music Theater. <laughs> Last year you did the amazing show-stopping hats and costumes for My Fair Lady. Um, it's a really fun place to work, and it's a really artistic atmosphere, and... You know, Lacage is, you know, it's a show within a show. Mm -hmm. So there's a drag show happening at the same time that there's this whole musical. But, you know, it's known for having outrageous costumes and kind of big show girly, sparkly, feathery way over the top stuff and so how could I turn it down? <laughs> Besides like the the Look height of the the height of the ceiling is like, you know, twenty feet. So how could I turn it down? Was yeah. that a real hat that they're wearing in the show with the big plume on top? Yeah. Mm -hmm. no. That's yeah. one of the smaller That's ones. That's a smaller one. No Stop way. It. Yeah. No. Yeah. They that literally hard to balance. Abs they're actually not that bad. Yeah. But we literally have girls <laughs> wearing actual peacock tails, the entire tail on top of their heads. Holy smokes. Unbelievable. There's thousands of feathers in the show because you know birds of a feather so we kind of decided to go mm -hmm. with kind of a bird feather theme with the costumes I and some of the that. jokes. How I many sequin that. did you use? <laughs> They're all over the floor. I haven't counted them all. Yeah. <laughs> Thousands. Yeah, see, a lot of people know you from season four, right, of Bravo's Project Runway yeah. as a, a finalist in the All-Star uh, <laughs> Challenge. Any stories that you want to share about some of your, your what, better known clients? <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, like Madonna, you know, right? It's so funny. Yeah. I mean, it's funny. You know, I had a dream last night about Meryl Streep. I just remembered that. That's funny. <laughs> oh, my, I've she told you before. Doing, all my friends call her Meryl Weep. She was, oh. <laughs> she was doing a... 
movie in my dream and asked me to make her a costume. I don't know. <laughs> That's awesome. That's crazy. I just remember that. And you worked with Beyonce too, right? Worked with Beyonce and Lady Gaga. I just got a call Prince. from Lady Gaga like two weeks ago asking me to make some stuff for her. Really? Um, yeah, you never know. They just... She's on you that big, um, smaller bar, dive bar tour, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. This is for the iHeartRadio thing in Las Vegas. Okay. And I don't know. I get calls from all sorts of crazy. I'm making a big dancing hamburger costume at the moment. Like that kind <laughs> of, you never know. That, who is that for? Um, it's a company called Impossible Burger. It's a new vegetarian That's burger. I love it. <laughs> that is awesome. That's fantastic. It's great to have you guys here. What a Thank fun you. show for people to see right here in Milwaukee. Incredible. Opens November 18th Friday. through December 23rd. So you got your big night coming up this Friday. It's at the Broadway Theater Center on North Broadway. It's the Skylight Music Theater. La Caja Fall. Use the code BLEND for 10% off your tickets. Call now at 414-291-7800 or you can go to Skylight Music Theater. Dot org. Great to see you guys. Thanks, Thank you guys. You. Thank, Thank you so much.